so here I've got a field. Um, we had some corn here. Uh, already picked the corn. Um, I've aerially seeded a cover crop mix. So there was like, I think, uh, 12, 13 different species in here. Uh, well, the rye, oats, um, radishes, and some of the uh, the dunes came through, but still some of the other cover crops uh, that was in the mix, I don't think made it. Um, we did get a rain two, three days after we aerially seeded it. So, uh, um, I don't know if the seed to soil contact was enough for some of the others. So yeah, there's some decent uh, radishes. Um, open a spot here. You can see there. Oh, I'm just going to take out this one. Uh, it broke off, but uh, yeah, radishes uh, came through quite good. Um, some cereals. Um, I'm going to take off one. Take out one of the cereals and a spot. Get another spot. I'll take one from here. Uh, there's some of the uh, Vavica. Not sure what they are in English. Uh, this is legume. I'll take out one of these. Oh, some nice earthworms, nice earth, earthworm activity uh, going on. I say I'm really happy with with what I'm seeing here. Get that guy into focus. And uh, one thing I noticed walking up into the field, you see all the earthworm, all the earthworm castings. So yeah, this soil is definitely being getting healthier uh, from the uh, the results that I'm seeing from the cover crops. So yeah, now I'm really happy. So a good amount of feed if you were to put in cows. So I won't be grazing this. I think I will be uh, rolling this and then plant into it.